Working Americans are looking forward to retirement despite the pandemic. One Augusta University educator shares his story on his new normal as a retiree, and you might be surprised about what he has to say. News Channel 6's Taylor Leverett has that story. Despite economic setbacks brought on by the pandemic, many working Americans over the age of 65 are still looking forward to the victory of retirement. Financial advisor Ryan Borders from Richard Young Associates suggests with the recent changes in the market brought on partly by COVID and the political climate, that it's more important now that retirees consider to have a financial plan set in place. One thing we tell people to do is look at how much you spend, especially if you're right at retirement. You know, look at your bank statements for the last three months um, and see how much you spend each month and then, you know, see how much that is over the whole year. And that kind of tells you how much you need each year. And can you cover that with your investments, your pension, um, your Social Security, things like that. A question many retirees have is whether to take their entire pension at once or receive a monthly distribution. Pensions are rarer these days, obviously. They're a great thing to have. Um, but you want to make sure you understand your pension before you go into retirement. That's the big thing we tell people, you know, so you don't get caught off guard. Today's dollars might not cover tomorrow's dollars, so you want to make sure you have a cost of living adjustment potentially. A piece of advice border stresses to future and current retirees is to sit down with a professional and fully understand all of your options as you prepare for retirement. Having peace of mind going into your golden years can be the difference between regretting or enjoying your golden years, like Pedro Oyo Salcedo, or Professor Pedro as he's known by his students. I'm doing now what I used to do during my last 50 years you know, reading, teaching, writing, advising, and having fun. Pedro Oyo Salcedo is among a lucky few who recently retired as an educator of 26 years at Augusta University. He says retiring in the middle of a pandemic didn't change much of his current normal. The new normal is my own normal. So I, I feel like mm, same as before, of course, there are a lot of new rules, a lot of, a lot of new concerns. Uh, I mean, the new, the new thing I'm, I'm feeling is just developing more common sense. Salcedo says one of the things he misses most is traveling, which he and his family plan on visiting his home country of Colombia once the pandemic is over. Having a sound financial plan is a piece of advice he'd give to educators and future retirees like himself. Do your homework and be calm. Smile, laugh every day, even to help with your wrinkles. In Augusta, Taylor Leverett, WJBF News Channel 6. Taylor, thank